These eggs are amazing. I need to make a cake with them. So let's get started. Grab your mixing bowls, break up the good vibes, and let's paint the oven with rainbow magic. Now gather the rest of our sugary squad. Egg, flour, ready to dance with Lucky Jake, and a sprinkle of vanilla for that oh so satisfying whisper of sweetness. Don't forget the melted chocolate. about the magic of baking. We'll need to get our egg whites nice and fluffy. To do that, we'll need to beat them on high speed until they form stiffly. Then gently fold and soften butter, like a pat of sunshine melting into a dreamy cloud. into six bowls and add a different food coloring to each. We're talking about fiery red, sunset orange, grassy green, sky blue, and maybe even a touch of mystical purple. Now, grab your trusty cake and slice that beauty into three even tiers. some icy fury with a layer of white frosting. Okay, it's time to get creative. Let's turn this rainbow cake into a real work of art. Now that we have our rainbow frosting ready to go, it's time to start decorating. Let your imagination run wild. Rainbow masterpiece. Step back, admire your handiwork, and bask in the pure enjoy of this rainbow cake masterpiece. I hope you enjoy this recipe. Let your baking spirit shine through and have fun. What a beautiful day! Rock, paper, scissors. Sure, let's play. One, two, three. One, two, three. Yes, I won. Should we make a cake today? Sure, let's make it together. Let's go. Hi, friends. I have a great story for you. In a faraway valley nestled between rolling hills, there existed a unique garden known as the Rainbow Blooms. It was said that the flowers in this garden possessed a magical quality. They could change their colors with the emotions of those who tended to them. An elderly woman named Eliza had cared for these extraordinary flowers for decades. Her heart was as colorful as the blooms she nurtured, and her garden was a testament to her boundless love and empathy. Each day, she tended to her rainbow-colored flowers, whispering stories of hope and laughter to them. One summer, a young boy named Leo stumbled upon the garden while chasing a vibrant butterfly. As he approached, he noticed the flowers shifting colors, matching the curiosity and wonder in his eyes. Mesmerized, Leo spent hours in the garden, sharing his dreams and aspirations with the blossoms. The rainbow blooms soon spread throughout the valley, attracting people from near and far. They came to pour their hearts out to the flowers, seeking solace, joy, and understanding. And in return, 
the blooms would change their colors, reflecting the emotions they absorb. Over time, the valley transformed into a place of love and harmony, where people learned to share their feelings openly and connect with one another. The garden became a symbol of unity, a reminder that even in a world of ever-changing emotions, the colors of understanding and compassion could bridge any divide. And so, the rainbow blooms continued to flourish. Their vibrant hues a testament to the power of empathy and the beauty that can bloom when hearts intertwine. This is our cake for today! Wow! Amazing! Let's try it together! Goodness, look at all this fruit. I need to find a way to use it all up. First, we need to chop up the fruit into small pieces. I'm going to use strawberries, mangoes, kiwis, and blueberries. If you don't have all of these fruits, you can use whatever you have on hand. Just make sure to use a variety of colors to get a beautiful rainbow effect. to our fruit puree. Let's be careful. Now, we're ready to pour the fruit puree into the cups. I'm going to start with a purple layer. Then I'm going to add a layer of milk to balance things out. And I'm going to end with a layer of red. Now, we're going to put the molds in the fridge to set. This will take about 30 minutes. Once the TH is set, we can start decorating it. I'm going to use some whipped cream and sprinkles. You can use whatever decorations you like. Just be creative and have fun. And that's it. We've made a delicious and beautiful rainbow jelly. Welcome, sugar fiends and sprinkle enthusiasts. Today, we're whisking ourselves away to Jenny's kitchen, where the ovens sing opera and cakes are more than just desserts. They're edible masterpieces. But buckle up, because today's story is about to take a rainbow-colored turn. A spark ignited in Jenny's mind, brighter than a freshly frosted cupcake. She grabbed a handful of flour, a splash of milk, and a mischievous grin. Today, basic ingredients weren't for boring bakes. They were the canvas for her culinary masterpiece. A rainbow cake so vibrant, it would make a unicorn jealous. Jenny's kitchen became a whirlwind of color. Eggs transformed into sunshine yellow batter. Milk swirled into sky blue clouds. And flour morphed into every shade of the rainbow. She layered the batter like a dreamy sunset each color singing against the other. But the cake wasn't just about colors. 
Jenny sculpted fluffy, marshmallow-like clouds from fondant, adding tiny rainbows and edible glitter-like scattered stars. This wasn't just a cake, it was a portal to a sugar-coated dreamscape. I really love rainbow! And cloud! Amazing! Let's go! Jenny's cake wasn't just a dessert! It was a reminder that creativity blooms in the most unexpected places! It sparked laughter, ignited imaginations, and proved that with a little bit of whisk and a whole lot of wonder, anything is possible in the kitchen! So bakers and dreamers, grab your ingredients, unleash your inner artist, and bake your own slice of the rainbow! Who knows, your next cake might be a swirling galaxy, a candy-coated jungle, or even a culinary masterpiece that makes unicorns cry with envy! Now go forth, sprinkle your magic, and bake your own story! Remember, the only limit is your imagination, and the kitchen is your canvas! So go forth, paint your own culinary rainbows, and don't forget to share a slice with your friends! Now that's the recipe for a sweet and delicious adventure!
with me today. Look at these ripe strawberries. Amazing. Only one is enough. Picking strawberries may leave them dirty, so be sure to wash them. to make strawberry jam. The fire here is always lit for cooking readiness. Always mix it up really well. A short break for your hands. What shapes these two chocolate colors form? The last move is to pour it into the mold. flag Enjoy with me Absolutely delicious Just a dream. Time to make that dream a reality.
person. Please ignore this and come home with me to make a new cake. In this big old bowl, we're blending flour, sugar, a pinch of salt, cream of tartar and cornstarch. Mix it up and let's get this chocolatey party started. Now, let's dive into liquid loveliness. In another bowl, we're beating together egg fresh milk, a dollop of cooking oil, and a splash of vanilla. It's the stuff dreams are made of. It's time to unite and excite. Pour that wet mixture right. And Nutella for that extra oomph into the dry party. And stir like there's no tomorrow. Pour our cockalicious batter into the mold. And let it work its magic in the oven for 30 to 35 minutes. Melt some purple. We're about to take our cake to a whole new level. Blue. Yellow. And pink chocolate in a cozy water bath. This is baking bliss. Cut that cake into three layers. Secure them with buttercream love. And give it a light brown buttercream coat. chocolate sauces, purple, blue, pink, and yellow. Top it all off with some fondant balls that are dressed to impress. And there you have it! Our sensational chocolate cake extravaganza!
begin baking same as always. The machine is a bit noisy, just bear with it. Anyone got a guess on the cake color? Let the baking begin now! Just a quick moment. Let the unicorn handle the rest. Wow, perfect. Check out this special buttercream edge. I want something extra on the top layer. Neat and tidy. the ones you make?
It's so beautiful! I will take a photo! Oh no! No more Nutella! I must buy another one! I buy it! Ouch! This! Okay! Have a nice day, everyone! Today, I will make a rainbow cake with Nutella! Cake! Thank you for watching me make this amazing cake! Oh, wow! I want to make a cake that looks like that!
Lucy, I'm craving some ice cream. Can you make me some? Sure, that's easy. Hey guys, it's Lucy. Today, we're going to make a triple flavored ice cream. Okay, let's make some strawberry and orange. little milk, this dish would be better. Now it's the main step, whipping cream with a little condensed milk. flavor ice cream, right? Add a little cacao to this one. Now, let's put the cream in the piping bag so it's easier to shape. That's it for today's recipe. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to subscribe to my channel for more delicious recipes. That's the right ice cream I like. It's so delicious, so yummy. Oh, thank you. I'd like to give you these strawberries as a thank you. Wow, really? Here you are. Thank you so much.
My mom. La, 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 la. Oh, hello. Thank you so much. It's amazing. Wait, I know what to do with them. Let's go. Good morning, my friends. I got some chocolates, so I will make a rainbow chocolate cake. about my cake. Wanna try it? So thank you for watching. Time to make a mess right here. Stop right there. Grab a seat and draw. I'll handle the sweets for you. today. For a healthy choice, go with fresh fruit ingredients. For a bit more color, shall we? Now we'll make some sweet fruit jams.
these candies into cute forms. He'll enjoy it. These sweets are so cute. Have a bite and see how it tastes. around here. Today, I'll show you how to make a delicious chocolate bar. Be sure your ingredients are squeaky clean. Oh no! Lucky it fell exactly where it should. of the chocolate bar. Soak them with sugar to get ready for making the jam. Treats need time, so hang tight for a bit. Take a bite. Beyond tasty. a different cake now.
for you. Thank you very much.